Good day, everybody. This is uh, Chris, and this is going to be Lab Exam 2, Answers Part 2. This will be uh, for the histology slides, and this is a Biology 225, Section D08, Human Anatomy and Physiology 1, Spring 2016. Let's go ahead and begin. All right, so slide number one was a slide of cardiac muscle, and you can see that it has a that characteristic branching pattern and very characteristic um, intercalated discs. So this is a very unambiguous slide and hopefully you guys did okay on this since this was a histology slide that you had to identify during the first lab exam. All right, so now we're looking at slide number two and slide number two is a sample of smooth muscle. You have these shorter, thinner, spindly uh, shaped cells. They are also uh, only have one nucleus or ununuclear, um, unlike uh, skeletal and cardiac muscle, uh, which tends to be uh, multinucleated. So this is uh, yet another example of smooth muscle. And uh, of course, you had to identify this during lab exam one. So this is really a review up to this point. All right, so here we're looking at slide number three. And uh, slide number three, uh, the specific structure that was labeled is here. Unfortunately, the crosshairs are not showing up real well on this particular picture. But as you guys saw during the exam, the crosshairs were centered on this structure here. And so what we're looking at is we're looking at a pancreatic um, tissue here, pancre pancreatic parenchyma. Um, this is all um, the asinus in through here, and this specific structure here is actually the endocrine, the active endocrine component of the pancreas, or the uh, pancreatic islet, or if you put the islet of Langerhan, you would uh, be uh, fine as well. Um, you're not required to identify individual cells within the islet, i.e. alpha, beta, or delta cells, just the islet structure itself. And then finally, we um, are moving on to the fourth slide. There were only four slides in this exam, so this exam was much lighter on histology than the first exam. And this is, you can see, a nice striated pattern here, uh, long and relatively thin fibers with uh, multiple nuclei, um, classic for skeletal muscle, and that's what this was. So. Those are the answers for your histology slides, and uh, hopefully you guys did well, and hopefully you found these two review videos helpful. As always, thanks for hanging in there.